Hi guys, it's Mel here from Mel W Scrappy. Um, I'm going to pop together a layout for you guys um, that I've used with scraps and bits and pieces and I've gone through all my little um, ephemera and found bits that sort of go. Um, just to do a quick layout for you. I'm going to go with the sketch for Follow a Sketch February that Sandy has on Scrapping Reflections Facebook group. And this is the sketch. And it's by Susan Stringfellow um, and that's one of hers and I'm gonna give it a go I just wanted to do a quick one just to prove that I don't have to spend so much time on things like I normally do I've just got it set out how I wanted it I've got these guys popped together how I want them that's right so it's just a matter of getting it all stuck down um, and then finishing off with some gems um, it's got a multi word title but I'm actually going to use that rainbow as my title um, there's no law that says you have to get letters out and just make it letters um, so parts of it is Amy Tangerine Brave and Bold other bits of paper like this one is the print shop, Vicky Booten. Um, then I've got different ephemera from different things. I'm a kind of person who will just mix and match. I just, that's me. I'm a mix and match kind of person. I'll move them up. I'll get this one underneath it. And I wanted to get the two photos that I had of my rainbows done. I thought, well, that's a good, this is a good sketch to actually put them both on the one layout. Like, I'm not doing, so one's just got a bit, one's a bit darker than the other. I think I need to go about there. If I've got it on straight, it will really help. Oh no, hey, let's just go with that. <clears throat> I haven't actually put any tape on the back of that. Oh, I'm slack. So it's been a, a bit of a day here. I, trying to get my daughter organized for school camp and then she got a bit of sinus so she couldn't actually go to school today and the teacher said well if she can harass today to get better for camp tomorrow so see how we go I don't know if they'll I'll don't start with any histamine and done the old COVID test to make sure it's not COVID and no it's not COVID but I'll do all that again in the morning just to double check and give them all peace of mind but she's determined this child of mine that she's going so I said to her don't be disappointed if we get to school and they say no you can't go they're too snuffly hopefully she's not been a little bit anxious about it all and I think that's probably and then we had athletics carnival on Friday just a quiet a bit of running and um, she did a brilliant job and it got really windy out there so I wouldn't be surprised if um, the wind has caused part of it I mean it got really windy and of course fr uh, Friday being mega mega hot day um which didn't help matters right. and that's out of this is a i think fernwood out of the fernwood one of the tags i've really got a mix and match thing here but i don't mind because it all looks pretty good together so And this is a 
completely different coloured flower, but I'm going to go over the top like that. Oh, where's my glue? I have to glue some of those leaves down. Done it again. Maybe I won't be gluing. Oh, there we go. I've got it on. not to have to glue any of this. That's going to stick up too much. Right now, I'm going with this rainbow. This is out of, oh, I think it could be family or I have no idea what to do with, but it's a Vicky Boot and something. I've just stuck a little rainbow coloured llama and a little, another little rainbow sticker on top of it. And this says, um, I'll tell you in a second. says some days you have to create your own sunshine. There's not that down in here. That was a really weird day that day. That's my gems I'm gonna finish off with and I'm gonna put some metallic rainbow coloured butterflies here and there. If I can get them off. To get the, they've got some dots. I'm going to do three. And this is out of the print shop. They're the puffy stickers. If I could get my them straight. And there was a dot under here somewhere. So let's go here like that. And I want this is really metallic here. Let's go that one there off. If we can get it off. These are just stickers from the um, cheap shop that we've got. Not that it's very cheap any, anymore, but um, let's go on there like that. And I might go. ones here the bottom and we'll do little rainbow stars around them there we go 
something like that. I have stuff out everywhere on my desk, so you'll have to forgive me. If I just kept pulling stuff out to see if it would work. Got some lines there to do some journaling. And let's stick some of the gems around. Alright, so we're going to go one up here, one over there, and one over here. I'm going to do three different colours. Because I've got black here. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm quite happy with how that's come out. I just wanted to do a quick one. A quick one to show you that you can actually do a quick layout when you need to. The majority of it is scraps and these old ephemera, old stickers. I'm trying to get some gems used up. And I'm happy with that a bit of a close-up of the rainbow butterflies metallic rainbow butterflies they look quite funny when you do that and that's my rainbow photos this one was the dark one and then it's I've got one that was a bit lighter so that's it that's what I've done for tonight for today so I hope you've all enjoyed watching this quick put together of layout uh, it's nothing flash, it's just bits of scraps left over popped together so that I can get two photos on there and it is extremely similar to the sketch. Except I haven't got a multi-word, I've just got a an ephemera piece that's got words around it for my, lo for my title. Um, because that day it was very cloudy and overcast, it had been raining, the sun was trying to shine through and yeah so... Hence my little llama with the rainbow over top. Okay, so thank you everyone. Um, there will be other people playing along with um, Sandy's scrapping reflections. Follow a sketch February. Um, I will have that linked down below. Um, if you click on the hashtag that I have on there, it'll take you to a lot of the other videos as well. Um, and I'll also have a couple of links down below as well of some of the people I know that are playing along nearly every day. I've tried to play along but I've kind of got a little bit behind so I thought I might get another one done. Um, and yeah, so thank you everyone. If you, think, if you do like what I've done, if you can give me a thumbs up, that would be great. If you're new to my channel, I hope I've done enough for you to consider subscribing. Um, I know it's a quick and easy one. But I just wanted to show my other subscribers out there that it doesn't have to be complicated. You don't have to use the best of everything. Use your scraps and just use some stickers where where we need to be. I've just classed that as one cluster, two clusters and my own little three cluster down here. Um, and that's how easy it can be. So thank you everyone for watching. Um, it doesn't cost to subscribe, like, or comment. Um, and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now. <laughs>